Yo, what's going on guys? It's Infection, and today I sweated my entire body off trying to beat the raid. Did we beat it? No, we didn't because we had people that we had to uh, go and do other things in their life, including myself. But I do want to hit y'all with some knowledge on this first room. So to do this, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk you through the whole thing real quick, and then we're going to see it in action. So you need to know the basic landscape of the room. There's a plate at the bottom left, the bottom right, the top left, and the top right, and in the middle. So you can think of the middle as like a refresh station. And if you are in this room and watching this, you've probably already attempted this and are saying to yourself, what the heck's going on? But to no end, we were doing the same thing and we finally got it. So this is how you do it. Okay, you're going to have three people to a side. You're going to have a floater. Well, everyone is eventually going to be floating around. We'll say that. But at the start, you'll have one person on each plate on the left and one person on each plate on the right. Everybody needs to hop on at the same time. So everyone will have 50 seconds counting down because you're, you're having to stand in the plate. Now, let me tell you this. As you're standing on the plate, you can see the chain where the bathers spawn out of the pool moving. And when you get off the plate, they stop moving. So you should always have somebody on the plate. Unless someone's about to die, then go ahead and hop off. It's more important to live. But everyone, someone should always be on the plate. So back to switching and everything. Once the plate, or once your timer goes down to about 20 or 25 or so, you should be switching spots with the floater who should have a full 50 seconds because he went and got a full 50 seconds from the quote unquote refresh station in the middle of the map to refresh himself because the timer only goes down when you're in the water so when he gets a refresh he should jump on the plate for you then the person who is just on that plate will go to the middle get the refresh ball kill an ad or two and then go to the opposite plate on the same side so if you're on the top then you go to the bottom plate and once you're on the bottom plate, you hop on and you have basically a full 50 seconds to stay on that plate. And you relieve that person on the bottom plate to go to the middle, refresh, and then go back up to the top. And you will do this until you'll hear a change. There's There'll be a tone that comes out and the music will change. I don't have my music on, so I couldn't really tell. But there is a tone that goes off and all the chains will stop moving. That is when everyone goes to the middle and all the ads will start going to the middle and bathers will start spawning in the middle. But more importantly, you have to stand on the middle plate to shoot the purple void looking is what it looks like. They're void filled canister looking things. And there's three on the, three on the top and left and right corner and three towards the back of the room. So in my advice here would be have your warlocks be storm callers, your titans be strikers and your hunters be golden guns as using the supers in the middle can really help you out with these bathers and you can choose any any order that you want to uh, and while someone is supering killing bathers and ads then everyone else needs to be shooting these purple canisters and try to team shot and be hitting the same ones at the same time uh, but keep in mind also that your invulnerability will run out to the water and you're gonna have to jump out onto the dry land and once that happens you can jump out onto the concrete and just start DPSing enemies while everyone else's runs out and make sure also that you kill the floating scions in the room because if you don't then a, a well I'm gonna call it a bomb will detonate and everyone will die so after you get as many purple canisters done as you can, I think we got six finished, then you literally just and kill the two sounds and then you'll literally restart the whole process over and then go back into the middle after you keep switching back and forth and the chain stop and the gong goes off. You'll go back to the middle, do the same thing, 
And as soon as you get the rest of those three or four or five or however many canisters you have left of the purple goop void stuff, then you will finish this room. It's not that hard once you finally get into a rhythm and get enough damage. It's going to be pretty tough if you're not high enough light level. But that is how you do it, guys. I hope this helps. Uh, it would have saved us two and a half hours or so in the raid because we didn't want to spoil it. So... We didn't really want to look anywhere. But guys, don't forget to keep it classy out there. I'm going to let y'all finish watching the rest of the video. And I will show y'all my genuine reaction when we got this completed. It's pretty funny. But yeah, guys, go ahead and watch this. And everything that I'm saying, it'll, it'll all go cohesively with what you're viewing in this video. I know I'm talking a lot and everything is kind of not super cohesive as I'm doing it in the video. But... It is all happening, and I tried to make this as easy as I could for y'all. So guys, enjoy. I'm coming, Langsner. Hurry. Okay, the buff's not here. I'm here, go, go, go. All right, I'm coming, Infection. Yeah, you're good, I got 15 seconds. No rush. This chain is done, by the way. Should be go, pretty go, close. Go, 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 go. I'm here, smoking. Razor should be spawning up soon. Yeah, watch out. I'm coming. I'm at 20. I got mine, I'm at 20. I'm at 28. Oh there. no. Oh my god. Oh gosh, I could have been bad. Just keep coming, T-Bag, whenever we get a chance. Yeah, coming. Hold on. Comment Langsner. Melted him. Can we go in the middle yet? No, 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 not yet. Just keep playing, keep, All right, get on, keep back. staying on. I have a storm to kill ads, by the way. Yeah. I, I go. might have mine off those orbs. Back to mid, back to mid, back to mid. Go, 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 mid, 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 mid. Put down all your roofs. If you have one, put it down. I have one. Right. Healing. Right. Use yeah, use two. your storm. No, we just gotta get one set, There's that's it. Let me use my storm. I don't have my storm. I, I got a, storm. I got a slam. Right, I got a slam. Oh, I got the ads. Don't worry about it. All right, keep going. I'll last, last one, one. Last one. Last one. There we. But before you see my genuine reaction, you gotta see this highlight. Man, I just farted and it made me feel so much. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> and now to the reaction. I got you. It's good. It's good. Yo, I got super. I got I super. I got super. I got super. I got super. Right. No, just keep DPS and keep DPS and I got I got y'all I got y'all. Keep doing it. Can't res you. Caleb, try and come get me. You don't have to get in the pool to get me. Yes, nice. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more. Right there, it's right there, it's right there, right there. I can't. Hey, baby. Keith. Oh, oh, oh. A chest. Let's get it. Yes. It's a chest. It's a chest. There's a chest, chest bro. Yeah. Damn, let's go, sons. Let's go, the pleasure garden. Let's go, sons. Finally. I didn't get anything. I didn't get fucking shit. I didn't either. I didn't either. What is this? I just got five tokens. I got tokens. I got tokens, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. If I die, I'm a legend. When they lay me down to rest, I know I was always ready.